The uh, last couple of days has actually been a little bit better for me. And by the way, if you like this video, please remember to like and uh, subscribe. I really much appreciate that. I am uh, still kind of uh, tired and I have um, some fatigue, but um, it has been a little bit better since uh, my last update. And uh, I have actually done some uh, changes. I have uh, reduced the amount of Diamox that I am taking to uh, one tablet every night. I did that yesterday, so I can't really evaluate the effect of that yet, but it might be possible that I am just so, so tired because of the medication. This is something that my neurologist, uh, last time I talked with him, said it was okay to do if I feel that I need to. And uh, I'm going to try that now for a couple of days or weeks and see how I respond to that. It might also be that I am in one of those periods where I feel more symptoms of my disease that happens for me sometimes. So that's a possibility. Yeah. But I've, I have had a little bit more energy than last time. So that's good. And I have been able to go out and do some physical exercise, which I know in the long end is really, really good for me. And uh, also something that I have noticed the last couple of days is my sleeping habits has been all over the place, if I'd say it like that. It's like I am waking up in the night and I also sleep a couple of hours during the day. So the total amount of hours that I have slept the last couple of days is more than usual. And uh, that usually is a sign for me that I am in one of those periods where my disease is, uh, where my symptoms is a little bit more severe. And also I have had a bit of uh, headaches since uh, last time I did an update and uh, unfortunately those headaches has been uh, quite severe and quite tough sometimes but uh, fortunately they have gone away pretty fast which is super great and uh, you know those headaches have come like just like that and uh, speaking of my mental health unfortunately i have been pretty locked in my apartment if so to say i have gone out for a couple of runs and stuff like that so that's been great but unfortunately the weather here in uh, northern sweden has been windy and rainy tomorrow i am going to meet one of my best friends and we are going to have lunch he is not living here in umeå but he is uh, passing by umeå on his way down south so going to eat some lunch and it's going to be really great i think i haven't seen him for um, maybe six months or maybe even more so that's going to be fun and uh, next week i'm also starting my work again after uh, my holiday i have a couple of days off and i start to work uh, at wednesday it's going to be so nice to go back to work and meet uh, my workmates and so on but uh, i i'm also not looking forward to it if, because if i have a lot of symptoms it's usually more tough for me to to work but I also know that it is so important for me to, to go to work, to meet my workmates and uh, just f get my mind to focus on something else instead. Yeah, and something that uh, I 
almost forgot to talk about is the twitching in my legs and arms that uh, have been going, going on for uh, a couple of days now. Uh, I am going to continue to monitor that and uh, I have a suspicion that it might be related to my medication. Uh, I'm not so completely sure about that, but that's at least my suspicion. And now when I have decreased my dosage, I'm going to see if that goes away or decreases. If it doesn't do that, I'm going to talk to my neurologist about that. Either way, I'm going to mention that to my neurologist next time that I have an appointment with him. It doesn't really bother me that much, but uh, I think that is something that I will have to keep in mind. I have no other neurological symptoms, otherwise that is not usual for me. And uh, with that said, see you in the next one. Bye.